Let's compare these two different hairbrushes. So the very first thing about these is that the bristle type, this one has a little ball at the end and this one does not. So there's a few different things about that. First of all, this makes it feel much more like massaging when you brush your hair with a little ball at the end. However, when you don't have that little ball at the end of the bristles, it's a lot easier to clean because the hair doesn't get stuck in there and you don't get like the dust pieces that get caught underneath the balls. So those are two different pieces of it. More massaging, easier to clean. The next thing is obviously the shape. This one is more of a square shape or this one is a round shape. And then the handles are a little bit different too. This handle fits my hand really nicely. It has a little spot for the thumb grip. This one doesn't have that. It's a little bit less comfortable to hold and it's a little short for my hand to grab the whole thing. Now, when I brushed my hair with both of them, um, my hair didn't get tangled in either one of them. It was really easy on both wet and dry hair. So there's, I say they're pretty evenly compared in that area. Overall, I really liked both of them. I think when it came down to choosing one or the other, it's really gonna come down to, do you like this type of bristle or that type? Are you looking more for something that's easier to clean or feels more massage on your head? So choose this one for massaging, choose this one for ease of cleaning, but you really can't go wrong with either brush.